Welcome everyone, Dr. Thor here again with another fascinating item from the past. You know, uh, Kreskin, like Yuri Geller, uh, made an awful lot of different items and had his name put on games and everything else. Here's a Kreskin actually pendulum, which is extremely rare. Let me put this up here so you can see it a little better. Um, so the K on here is for Kreskin, and this was something you, I don't know how much these sold for, so they're very difficult to find. He's got two styles of this. This is the most rarest type, which has this K on it, which he activates with his mind power. And on the other side, of course, it says, um, this thought is becoming stronger. Kreskin. Now, you held this in your hand and you empowered whatever thoughts you had by holding it in, I don't know if he said to hold it in your left hand or not, we don't really have any instructions on this. Um, and you would actually wear this, very similar to the pendants that we offer, the MECTAC, the uh, manifesting energy cells. Well, this was uh, supposed to have his energy in it, and you would think of something, hold it, or you'd hold the pendant like this, think about it, and it would strengthen your thought form. Pretty cool. I mean, it's a good idea, and, uh, you know, he was this great mentalist, and still is, uh, where he uses a lot of tricks uh, to pretend they are psychic, uh, and, of course, is one of these uh, many uh, dumb bunkers out there and idiot skeptics, uh, unfortunately. But, you know, he is an intelligent man. He's written some very interesting books um, on using your psychic powers, both uh, legitimately building your brain power and also uh, doing different tricks. Uh, and he does tricks. He's not doing everything as mine. But he's an extremely advanced person. He has studied mentalism, which is the uh, magician's psychic faking art. And there are some real things there. Watching subtle movements, seeing everything that happens so he can detect what you're thinking. These are all things you can actually do, and he's a master of it. Um, and a certain percent of the time, he can work like everybody else uh, on a pure psychic level. But generally, everything he does is tricks, and he has no sympathy for anybody, um, any, quote, occultist. And um, I believe he's also, he's a Polish, uh, I, uh, Polish Italian, and um, seems to have a uh, fairly strong... Um, Christian viewpoint as well, I believe. I'm not sure about all that stuff, but um, he's typically, and he was back in the 70s as well when he was trying to milk money from things like this, otherwise known as good luck charms, um, from the public, he was still pretty hostile to anybody who was metaphysical or who was a witch, etc. And you can find those on his uh, on the reproduction of some of his, his TV show he had out of Canada in the 70s. So I hope you've enjoyed this piece. This is another rare piece you're only going to see here. And um, lots more to come. Stay tuned.